It's really difficult to read the name of the station. Let me show you some. So this is Hanbo, and this is the English type. Can you read this one? <laughs> Guan, Guan, Man? It's quite difficult, eh? It's really hard to pronounce it. So if you cannot pronounce it, you cannot tell when it is said in the announcement. And even worse, I said there are four different languages in the announcement. And Japanese announcement comes very last. So what happens here is, when the train is coming to stop, only when that moment you can hear the Japanese announcement. So you have to make a quick decision whether the announcement says this one or not. <laughs> So that you can miss the station. And also, when the Japanese announcer said, the other part is that they speak in fluent Japanese, but only this part, they become very fluent in Korean. It's like, Sugi ni to marimasu no wa, wa 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 No, I can't catch it! What did you say? So, visiting a new foreign country always gives me a challenging experience and lesson. Before visiting Seoul, I thought, oh, it's easy, it's a piece of cake to travel around Seoul because I can speak English. People can speak English. But in fact, it was not. I was, I was at loss. So, I was being really arrogant, foolish, Immature. Of course, I was immature. I was immature enough to believe actually the Incheon Airport and Seoul smells like kimchi, right? So you can speak English. So what? Sometimes you need to get out of comfort zone and recognize how small and how imperfect you still are. Now, do you want to get out of your comfort zone? If yes, then go to the soul. I assure you that soul will shake the soul and make you fat. Thank you.